Well, getting back to a community that molded Samra Osmanovich, her family and friends ordering wristlets for patients at Galasano Children's Hospital. She and her two friends were killed more than a year ago by a drunk driver along Route 173. But as News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc shows us, her family wants to remember who she was and not what happened to her. 20-year-old Samra Osmanovich left a mark on everyone she encountered. She was just this person that could approach you and you instantly loved. Like she just had the sass. A sass and sparkle her older sister Sadita and others say could never fade. Though her life was taken too soon. Samra and her two friends were killed by a drunk driver last February. Now those who know Samra are not letting what happened to her define her. I want people to remember her because she was an energetic, loving, caring, inspiring, um, determined young woman that um, would have spent her entire life giving back to people. That's why they're giving back to the one place Samra spent most of her childhood, Galasano Children's Hospital. She was diagnosed with bacterial meningitis at just three years old, losing her arms and legs to the disease. But that never held her back. It was a lifelong battle, but she still smiled <laughs> every moment. I know she would want to share with people her perseverance and her strength, um, because without those things, she wouldn't have been where she was. In her honor, friends, family, and strangers are customizing these wristlets and putting goodies inside to give to patients, leaving a note reminding them who Samra was and what she stood for. Hopefully they, they recognize this is a little a little glitch, you know, a little hurdle for them. Just to inspire these teenagers that, yes, live each day to the fullest and there will be bad days and good, but if you smile and make the most of it, there's a light at the end of every tunnel. A light still shining in Samra's spirit and one you can see in everyone who got the chance to meet her. Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9. Sounds like a beautiful soul who will certainly be missed. Now, once the orders are in, the wristlets will be filled with things the teens and kids at the hospital can pamper themselves with, which is something Samra loved to do. Those deliveries will be made within the next few weeks.